All right, so this is part two of the uh, the inventory. So we, we made the inventory last time in the last video. And um, at the bottom here, we created the print inventory and the add to inventory and the inventory uh, list itself. We then added that to the Deep Forest South location uh, here. And it's Deep Forest South, we added the inventory. So let's just run it and see what happens, see if it works. So my name is Fred. Uh, I want to go to the forest. I'm going to the forest. I'm going to describe what the forest looks like. If I go right through the undergrowth, it allows me to push through and I get into the deep forest south. So now I can get the spear. And I've picked it up. Um, and I can say I for inventory. It tells me that I'm carrying the spear. Uh, the only thing that's annoying is that it still tells me that there's a long spear-like stick on the floor in Deep Forest um, South, and I've already picked it up and I'm carrying it, so that is a bit annoying. So a way to fix that, or one way we could fix that, is to add a little bit of code here at the top. So here I am in Deep Forest South, so if the spear is in the inventory, then I've already picked it up. Um, and so I don't want it to um, be still on the ground. So if the spear is in the inventory, I've changed a little variable message here to nothing. Now, it, otherwise, I've changed it to a long spear-like stick, which is what the description was before. So in here, I've added a plus, and I'm going to remove a long spear-like stick from the description. And instead of that, I'm going to put my variable insert into there. And so now let's try to see if that has made a difference and made it work better. So I'm still going to be Fred, still in the meadow. So I'm still going to the forest. Here we go. We're in the forest. I'm still going to go right. And there we are. We can see the spear. Uh, so we're going to get the spear. I've got the spear and now it says you see on the ground nothing instead of the spear and if I inventory I can see I'm carrying the spear so that made that bit work a bit better and so you're not carrying the spear and you're still seeing the spear um, so that is um, dealing with annoying duplicate items in rooms that shouldn't be there anymore now the other thing that you need to do is uh, to add your inventory command to all your other locations so you could find out what's in your inventory at any time. So the bit of code for that was the LF choice equals equals I print inventory and you can just copy that code and you can take that to your other location. So let's go back to my uh, meadow location and we can paste that in. So LF choice is I, just the only problem with that is the indent. So we can just indent that LF choice equals I print inventory. And I've just popped that straight in there now on my meadow. So I can now use I in there as well. You can put that in all of your locations.